Oh my heck, oh gosh, yay. Oh, hi, friend. <laughs> I was just going through my camera of uh, pictures that I took of my beautiful home state of Utah, yay. <laughs> um, most Utahns are Mormons, and I am a Mormon myself, um, but not everyone in Utah is a Mormon, <laughs> despite our best efforts, um, and they don't appreciate being lumped into us, so keep that in mind, but we were here first, so there you go. Um, Utah's really great. There are a lot of misconceptions about our state. Um, people think that we are just cultish hicks living in the desert. Not so. Um, first of all, we, it is very arid here, but we do have snow. Um, ooh, Park City. Um, oh, oh, except during the uh, Sundance Festival of Sin. <laughs> very bad. But we do appreciate the tax dollars. <laughs> but don't watch the movies. They're bad. Um, and it rains, um, sometimes uh, dirt, <laughs> which is an exciting phenomenon if you haven't seen it before. And um, we are not cultish hicks. We, we love our guns, but loving guns does not a hick make. And we love our church, and that doesn't make us cultish. So you have us confused with someone else. Um, there are so many mis- You know what? Fun facts about Utah um, that might surprise you. We have the uh, highest usage rate of uh, antidepressants in the country. Yay! <laughs> um, it's mostly among our women, um, but they are so happy. We are happy and it has nothing to do with that. <laughs> they feel very secure in their lives. Um, they are just depressed at how sad the rest of the world is, <laughs> and that's why they take them. Um, we also have the highest uh, rate of uh, plastic surgery and uh, boob jobs in the country. Um, and unrelatedly, oh, that mainly for women, of course, and uh, unrelatedly, the highest use uh, per capita of uh, porn. <laughs> Stop, guys! <laughs> Which does not contribute to women's insecurity complexes. Okay, so, Utah was founded by the Mormons. We were here first, so <laughs> uh, quit complaining or leave. <laughs> we were here first. Find your keeper. Um, Brigham Young led the pioneers across the plains, and, uh, oh, you can go to Wyoming and you can do the trek, and it's awesome because you can push handcarts onward on some sunny day, and you can... It's, brothers and sisters, I know that they experience so much things. Anyway, so it's great. Do that. Um, and they, they... Oh, the Mormons were not looking for the Pacific Ocean. That has been said, uh, mainly because Mormons themselves said that's where they were going. But it was a joke. It was a joke. We knew we were going to Utah. Of course, we wanted to go to the desert. That was our goal, right? <laughs> it's the promised land. <laughs> we did not run into the Great Salt Lake, which is a giant <laughs> saltwater body that you can't see across. It looks just like the ocean. <laughs> and, uh, of course, so we knew it was a lake and not the ocean. Of course, there are seagulls in <laughs> the desert. <laughs> and not at the coast. So we knew. And uh, Brigham Young said, this is the place. And so it was. And it is. So that's how we got here. We we uh, we left the country because we were escaping persecution. Um, it had nothing to do with polygamy, I repeat. Um, but we wanted to call our state uh, Deseret. And the government said, no. <laughs> they are mean. <laughs> um, so we called it Utah. <laughs> um, it's Zion to us. <laughs> we're Jews. <laughs> um, Salt Lake City is the capital of our state. And it's where the government is. We are not a theocracy. Oh, gosh. We are a democracy. This is part of America. <laughs> what are you questioning? Gosh. Um, majority rules. So if the Utah majority of Mormons votes for Mormon representatives, that's just the way it is. If non-Mormons believe that their voting is <laughs> cancelled out by this Mormon block, then uh, you can vote. Okay? So, there. Um, Mormons are very conservative, it's true. We believe in small government, and so you might think that it's hypocritical because Utah has more laws per person than any other state. Um, but actually, no. Again, we, we only use big government as a way to protect you from bad government <laughs> because these more rules are Mormon-friendly. So it's big government, but it encourages small government. Small government being Mormons. Okay, gosh, okay, never mind. So, um, but drinking is hard. If you want to drink, go to Nevada. It's fun. You can drink here. You can't do the lotto. You can drink if you go to special designated places. Um, well, well, you don't want to do that anyway, right? No, okay. Um, Salt Lake City, though, is great. It's where Temple Square is, and the Tabernacle, and the Conference Center, yeah! <laughs> And the church actually owns um, most of Salt Lake City. Oh, but through various subsidiaries and other companies. But it's all under the uh, tax-exempt umbrella, um, as it should be, because it's the Lord's work. <laughs> of course real estate is the Lord's work. <laughs> oh, making people <laughs> work hours and for $3 worth of food is, uh, it builds character. Okay, so we don't want to just hand it out to them. That would be dumb. Um, Utah County. Utah County is where uh, Provo is. Uh, it's the best part of Utah. Yay! <laughs> it's where BYU is. And, uh, oh, when you fly over the state, you will look down and you will say, oh, look how holy it is here. There are churches everywhere and temples. And there are. Yay! It's awesome. Oh, churches everywhere, on every street, and the streets, uh, we, we do not have street names in Utah, usually, um, unless it's about the temple, uh, or the tabernacle, and we, it's all just on a grid system, it actually makes sense, so you just go by numbers, and it's actually like one of the more practical, believable things that has come out of Utah, <laughs> not that, I mean, everything is believable, especially the church, um, now, the southern part of the state is called Dixie, I wish I were in the land of, um, we, uh, we, it's like our south, <laughs> we didn't have slavery, um, because we didn't have black people. Um, not that we encouraged slavery. We we supported the Confederacy <laughs> during the Civil War because the rest of it doesn't matter. <laughs> but actually, just pretend that I didn't tell you that. Um, there were black people, so we sent Scandinavian white people like me, <laughs> my ancestors actually, to the southern part of the state to grow cotton. Now, cotton doesn't grow in the southern part of Utah. <laughs> but we tried. <laughs> and when it finally rained, it was a miracle. <laughs> and we used that to encourage faith. It had nothing to do with natural weather. 
Um, and, uh, oh, also, people in Southern Utah talk kind of differently. <laughs> I just tease, though. I love my family in Southern Utah. Hi, guys! <laughs> um, and, okay, driving. Driving in Utah is scary. Um, yeah, it's our only, it's our only outlet, guys. <laughs> the rest of our life is so regulated, and regulation is good, <laughs> is that we, okay, the left lane is the slow lane, and the right lane is the slow lane. <laughs> you can pass in the shoulders, um, you can do whatever you want, um, and speed limits are suggested, okay? And, oh, unless you have out-of-state license plates. <laughs> We're not nepotistic or anything. Um, oh, shopping! Oh, we love shopping. City Creek, yay, go! <laughs> um, we also have lots of Walmarts and Costco's, um, <laughs> to buy all of the ingredients for casseroles and Jell-O. Ooh, Jell-O is the state snack of Utah. Officially, it's true, the government <laughs> enacted that, it's true. <laughs> not Government. Anyway, so, um, oh, just don't go shopping on Saturday nights because that's when uh, Mormons go because they have to get ready for the Sabbath. Um, and on Sunday, um, do all your shopping. Uh, you should be in church, but if you do your shopping, um, just go before noon because that's when we are all in our <laughs> steeple buildings. And uh, after noon, then there will be a flood of white shirts and floral dresses. You know, Mormon women don't realize that floral dresses make them look better than they are, but they do. But it's springtime and it's so pretty, so it <laughs> doesn't add to any of those insecurity complexes that we talked about earlier. Um, oh, and if you go to the southern part of the state, you will find the plagues in the Walmarts there. Um, we, you know, for a religion that we, uncomfortable, it's just, <laughs> never mind, <laughs> never mind, just pretend I didn't say that. So, there you go, that's everything. Oh, and the last thing, because I said shopping on Sundays, um, Utah Mormons do not have to follow the same rules that other Mormons in other states have to follow, because we are more holy or something than them, so it's a suggestion. And besides, Chakarama is the best place to eat after church. <gasps> Yay! Okay, so, now you know everything there is to know about Utah. And uh, I can't wait for you to come. Yay! <laughs> and we'll see you soon. All right, okay, so bye! <laughs>